this is a quick introduction on setting up an environment for AI automation using a team of AI agents. We're going to use financial analysis as the first use case to get started. Specifically, we're going to use fundamental stock analysis with SEC 10K data. So what is this SEC 10K data? SEC 10K data, 10K data is a comprehensive report that is filed annually by a public traded company about its financial performance, and it is a requirement by the uh, SEC. This report contains a lot of detailed information and is sent to shareholders uh, before an annual meeting. So this is uh, a source of great insight for value investors to understand deeply about a company. So the use case that we're going to uh, do specifically is to automatically analyze uh, this SEC 10K data to gain a deep understanding of a company. In this case, we're going to take NVIDIA as an example of the company that we're going to uh, deep dive in with our AI agents. So one of the key things uh, that we, we can do with the crew of AI agents is the ability for it to figure out the right questions to ask uh, given a certain prompt. So we'll, we'll see that uh, in action shortly. And at the end of the analysis, uh, it's going to produce a report that gives us much deeper insight about a company. So to set the stage, uh, we're going to uh, set up a AI crew. So this is a team of agents, and there's going to be three personas. The first is a uh, senior research analyst. They're responsible for interacting with the SEC 10K data and uncover insights into the company NVIDIA. The second uh, persona is a visionary. So this visionary develops uh, or does deep thinking on the implications of analysis uh, that's done by the senior research analyst. So this is uh, looking at the implications of technology, implications of the analysis. And finally, there is a senior editor who writes professional quality articles that are easy to understand. So they are, are the one that uh, puts everything together to present a report. So how we're going to uh, build this out is uh, we're, going to, we're going to use uh, two main technologies. One is uh, Crew AI. So Crew AI is a AI agent framework that's designed to enable AI agents to assume roles like uh, what uh, we shared in the previous slide, uh, to share goals so that they can work together on a common task and work together in a cohesive uh, unit, uh, just, just like a, a team would uh, in, in real life. And this uh, crew of agents, uh, it, this framework allows us to express interactions of agents in, in a much easier way. So this is, um, uh, on uh, on one hand, uh, the the crew of agents that will drive the analysis. On, on the right-hand side, uh, we're taking a no-code or low-code approach uh, to, um, uh, to, to uh, help drive this uh, uh, analysis. So um, on the right-hand side is a flow, visual flow that I'm using with a tool called N8N. And so there's going to be a template in the uh, replit that I will show uh, shortly, uh, which uh, um, has this flow. And essentially, um, this is a Q&A flow. So uh, we load in the SEC 10 data, 10K data into uh, this vector store, and this is the retrieval part of it. So um, the crew of AI agents will call into this uh, webhook and then get this information back to help answer the questions about um, NVIDIA. All right, so here's uh, at the end what the report will look like, uh, and I'll give you uh, a, a view. So this is the report that the crew of agents uh, will uh, produce, an example of a, a report. So it will uh, give you a lot of uh, comprehensive information about uh, this company, the key business models, the uh, breakthrough technologies, potential industry impacts, uh, competitive landscape, major risks, and come up with a conclusion. So this is all from uh, fundamental analysis with uh, SEC 10K uh, information. So let's go ahead and dive into uh, the environment uh, that produces this and, and we'll look more into the, the details of, of the flow. Okay, so let's uh, walk through the uh, development environment. So in the uh, video uh, below, I will put a link that uh, gives you uh, a link to this uh, replet. So this replet allows you to just uh, fork your own and just create a development environment uh, exactly like this very easily, right? So you can take this URL and then you fork it. And then uh, and then when you go to uh, main.py, uh, you'll have uh, this code. So uh, this code actually has uh, uh, additional commented out um, 
uh, things that enable you to do web searches. And um, I've added also uh, a, a um, section here for OpenBB tools that we'll add to that uh, in a future video. So, so there's um, uh, um, a lot more capabilities in here, but let's start with just the uh, SEC, SEC tools, okay? So SEC tools is uh, what uh, we're using here to call into NA10. So in this tool here, I've uh, created uh, something that uh, you know tells the large language model uh, that this is a tool about uh, SEC, SEC 10K about NVIDIA and that it's useful for answering fundamental questions about NVIDIA from the SEC 10K. All right, so then, uh, when the AI uh, uh, determines that it needs to use the tool, it's going to call into uh, this web uh, hook here. Right? This web hook is uh, environment variable that you set in your secrets. Right? So um, I'll also link to a video on, on building the uh, chat with your data flow in NA10. So I'll do that in the link. Uh, so I, you know, I have this tool and I instantiate the tool here. Now, I'm using a service here called uh, together.ai. Uh, one of the things I like about this service is that it has a lot of um, a, a, a large amount of open source models. One of the open source models that we're using here is this one by News Research. I, I just found that this to be a, a quite a good model uh, that's uh, based on the Mistral uh, Small, uh, which is uh, a, the, one of the first open source uh, mixture of experts um, uh, large language model. So this is this is quite a good one. And uh, when you sign up for together.ai, they give you a $25 credit. Uh, so it, it's just really uh, handy uh, when uh, doing um, this kind of experimentation. So um, I've put in their base URL in here. And now in this section of code, all I've done is defined uh, the three agents, uh, the senior research analysts. And then I go into some more details into what they do. And the visionary, go into some details here in terms of what they do. And then the senior writer and or editor, uh, some details here. And then this part here is then the task that we're asked, uh, we're asking this uh, crew of agents to do. All right. So the first task is uh, done by the senior um, researcher, and they're going to conduct a comprehensive analysis. This is the uh, different things that they're going to be doing. And the expected output is a full analysis in bullet form. Uh, this is a, the second task is done by the visionary and uh, they uh, take the output and they uh, dive deeper into it right they dive deeper into the uh, results of uh, what the senior analyst does and finally the third task is done by the writer uh, who summarizes and, and makes it a uh, professional writing quality so let's go ahead and then uh, try this out and i can explain what it's doing right so to run it i go python main.py All right, so it's uh, running the first task uh, by the senior uh, research agent. You can see this, and look what it's doing. Uh, it's asking, so so the AI is figuring out uh, what questions to ask and what tools to call to answer the question. So uh, it's figuring out what are the risk factors and then calling the tool. And inside this tool, it's calling the NA10 workflow and answering that question. All right, so it's going to go through and cycle through and. Uh, iterate through. So I'll look at the other question, uh, who are NVIDIA's com uh, competitors and how does it compare to them? You know, so it's figuring out based on this initial prompt, what are the specific questions to ask? And then it's going uh, to the NA10 flow, which then uh, chats with the, the um, uh, chats with the vector store and it finds the answer. All right. So then uh, the senior analyst uh, has finished their work and now the visionary is adding to it, right? So it's taking this task and it's adding uh, more uh, insight into it. So you can see additional insights here. And then finally, uh, it's going to uh, uh, work with, uh, have a conversation with the senior uh, uh, research analyst and, and ask more questions so that it can uh, get more insight, All right? So there's more insight here. And then you can see it processing and thinking more. And now we're going to the senior editor side. So this person is uh, uh, taking that information from both the senior analyst as well as visionary and pulling it together uh, for a report. So um, that's 
uh, kind of the, the gist of how, how this works. Um, I've put into a section here of the template. So this is your the NA10 uh, template, and you can use this into NA10, and I'll, and I'll link that into the, the, uh, uh, the video section as well, OK? Um, all right, uh, so so um, hope, hope this helps to get uh, uh, you started. And uh, um, let me know uh, in the comments if you have any questions.